Hello everyone, today in this video we will be discussing the following uh, concepts which is the mouse activity and keyboard activity. Okay, in mouse activity we have three uh, activities which we will be discussing and same goes with keyboard activity also. We will be looking with the example uh, how to implement each of these. Now let's go to the first one which is click activity. Okay, so for click activity uh, you have to go to um, the activity panel and here if you type okay let's just type mouse activity in that all the three will appear okay we'll be uh, seeing each one by one so if you uh, drop the click activity here it will ask you to indicate on screen which activity you want to click so i'll be clicking on recycle bin okay so if you just observe when i uh, debug the file or run the file what will happen is at that time uh, the mouse cursor will go to recycle bin and it will click on it okay so let's have a visualization of that See, the mouse uh, cursor went to that uh, place, right? That's all what was there in the click activity. Let's move on to the next one, which is the double click activity. Okay, so let's have a look how the double click works. Same way as the click works, just it will double click on that particular thing. So if I indicate on screen for recycle bin, it will just open recycle bin, right? Because if you double click on some icon, it uh, what will happen? It will obviously open, right? So let's have a, a look of that. Run file. Uh, went and double click that okay so that was about the uh, double click recycle bin let's move to the third one which is hover hover means just um, point the mouse over there okay what point the mouse over there so that's all what will happen if i indicate uh, the recycle bin hover it will just hover over it if you hover over something at that time what will happen it will just uh, tell a slight information regarding that icon right if you hover over anything right main sequence if you hover over it will tell a few sentence about what is main sequence about so that's all what is hap what will happen in hover as well so let's have a look at that it will go the mouse cursor will go over the recycle bin and it will stay at that place itself without clicking or doing anything so it will say contains the files and folders okay that was about the hover we are done with the mouse activities let's move on to the next one which is the keyboard activities send hotkey send hotkey means what the keyboard shortcuts okay so let's have a visualization of that with an example so if i write here send uh, hotkey it will ask me uh, you want alt control shift win so i'll be trying win r it will open the run the run uh, command uh, line that it will open so let's have a look of that how it works the keyboard will automatically press the win uh, key and the r key okay So what should open? Run activity should open, right? So that's what it will open. Okay. Run activity opened here. That was about the hotkey. Let's move to the next one, which is type into. Type into you have already seen if you have been following my tutorials. I have used many times type into. So let's have a visualization of that as well. Then finally, we'll uh, see that type secure text. Okay, type secure text is not that simple one. It is a bit complicated it, uh, only okay so let's have a look at this one type into indicate on screen where you want to type into i'll be typing out to here so the cursor was in this position right i'll make the cursor here fine now what i want to type let's type some animal name like buffalo don't know if the spelling is correct or not but who cares want to see the working of this so what it will do it will go to the notepad and it will type that name wherever I had set the cursor okay so this was typed now this was the normal text okay so our last concept is regarding the type secure text so let's have a look at how that works I'll delete this one I'll drag and drop type uh, secure text okay now to type secure text you need to um, you know uh, first create a type secure text variable so created a variable okay I'll delete this one no props I'll create a variable called as X 
and that will be of the type um, not string the system secure string okay this one how I got I'll show you just go here and type secure very slow system secure okay secure uh, string so secure string you'll get here okay that one will be I used so you can use that one and this will be there system dot secure string and you cannot just directly enter a default variable here if you enter it will show error if you want I can show as well so I'll be typing this one and making it like this but it will not take uh, that value it will show error what's the error it cannot be converted to a secure string okay means this is the string type it's not secure string type so for that what we have to do first well, let's indicate on screen where we have to type it okay so let's have a look at this one after buffalo we'll be typing the secure whatever we want okay there only we'll be typing the secure text as well and how do you uh, write what is in the x okay so for that i'll have to use a sign in assign I'll be assigning the value of x so I'll be writing x here to x what is what is uh, to be assigned to assign something to x I'll be using the advanced editor and this is the thing which you need to write okay new system dot net dot capital N network credential and inside the bracket you will be write first not writing anything second one you will write whatever you want to write I'll write one two three four then after that uh, point you'll just type s it will show secure password just write it enter okay this is the uh, thing you need to write okay new system dot uh, net dot network credential in bracket the first thing nothing you'll write the second code you'll write to whatever you want to display in the text dot secure password you'll click ok and this is assigned to x and coming to the type secure uh, editable text in that where uh, with secure text it should be uh, it's stored in the variable x right that should be only written so that's all i will be running this file and seeing if it works so after buffalo what should be written one two three four okay so if that works you'll wind up this video done uh, you can see the one two three four here that's all what was about the secure uh, secure text we are done with the mouse activity and keyboard activity in this video and uh, make sure you hit the like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one